it was a reason to get up in the morning. I mean, it'd be nice to get a, have a reason to get out of bed. Well, it's nice to meet somebody, talk to somebody, for I'm in my own all day. There's no buses here. I'd have to walk to the top of the road or Belahi and I couldn't do it. Even when I was on my feet, I couldn't have done it. And I used the service for take me to Mahara and any place I want to go. I spent 33 years teaching and I took early retirement and then decided to help the people who live in rural areas and lift them, take them to shopping, hairdressing, appointments. I just like the idea of helping people. We're paid 45p per dead mile, which is just us going to the house and then 50p per live mile uh, while the person's in the car. That has been the, pri the cost uh, for a number of years. So at the minute, when things are more expensive, then you, you find the difference. Because of the cost of living and everything's increasing, it had come to the stage where I was actually paying to do the job. But speaking to my own neighbours who, who I picked up, a lot of them don't have anybody else. They have said that it's been a big loss because they, they haven't had anybody to step in and do the job. The volunteers that we're losing, it's geographically and um, we don't have the same spread of coverage that we would like across Northern Ireland so this is you know really vitally important that the UK government step up and review that rate. I love the job, still do if I could do it where it wasn't cost me money. It's very important to me and I'm sure many another person as well. <laughs> 